too soon to start planting in your soil, but you want to check the soil moisture level first. It's important to see if the soil is workable because you don't want to destroy the soil structure. If the soil is too moist, you'll compact it and you'll press out the air, and that will really cause some problems. So looking at a soil like this, obviously waterlogged, so that if you were to work this, you would really press and destroy the structure of the soil, which is important for the roots. Why that's important here often in Illinois is our heavy clay soils. And so here's a little bit about how the clay can look. It's a little bit lighter color. And this is not bad soil. You see I have earthworms that really help for uh, making the soil, soil porous. Um, but this is where you could have problems if this is too moist when you work it. That clay actually becomes almost like a ceramic. This is a great soil moisture level. Uh, so here is the soil. I dug about four inches down. It's very crumbly, kind of uh, breaks away. A good soil moisture is when you have little clumps that crumble when you press upon them. You can also make a soil ribbon by squeezing the soil, making a clump, and then if it breaks apart or crumbles away, that too is a good soil moisture level to work at. Why are you working it? Well, you might be adding compost, manure, or other soil amendments to the soil before you plant. And right now, you're getting ready maybe to plant some of your spring plants or your early season flowering materials.